my parents are trying to figure it out backstage. Existía una canción que nunca se nos mencionó y que nadie tenía. No tenía ni el DJ, no la tenía yo, no estaba en el plano, no estaba en nota. ¿Cuál canción me está pidiendo? La maestra ya no se presentó, por eso yo tuve que moverme para decirles que esa no eran las canciones. Pero el del DJ me dijo, es que la maestra me mandó, fue esto lo que me mandó. Para mí fue muy frustrante también el poder, el tener que estar lidiando con el DJ, con la mamá, con, el, con las otras personas que habían entrado. Todo eso causó demasiado estrés en ese momento. I was trying to keep it together. We had to stay there for a while until he got the song. I felt like, oh my god, like this is a disaster. Like everyone's like, oh my god, like she like I'm so bad at planning stuff. Aquí, aquí está Fui a decirle como tres veces y seguía lo mismo y lo mismo. Pues en eso me frustré y dije tengo que sacar esto para la que los niños no les pase yo ese estrés que yo tengo. Fue bastante estresante todo ese momento. I'm doing the waltz right now, and I thought I was gonna be really nervous when like everyone was gonna see me, but I think I was actually more nervous at practice than like in front of everyone. Estresada, me tenía estresada a lo del vals. La maestra última hora ya no se presentó. Yo la tuve que hacer de maestra porque los niños no se sentían confiados de los pasos que les puso la maestra y yo como dándoles ese apoyo por eso estuve ahí. Pero me gustó. I'm happy that like I just had chamelanes because like everyone was just looking at me and sometimes like the damas can steal a little bit of your like light away. So like the father and daughter dance, like it was emotional because like my dad was like talking to me and like I was just like thanking him for the party and you know, like we're like really close so it was just like you know like our moment. Porque okay, tuvimos otra complicación con lo del vestuario por el estrés y todo también Emily perdió más peso entonces el vestido ya era demasiado grande para ella. So the Selena outfit, like it was fine, it fit right, but then here in the middle, it just didn't work. Yo corriendo para todos lados, metiéndome en la cocina hasta que finalmente pude llegar a la cocina con un este, con uno de los de los meseros y le dije, le digo, güey, necesito un seguro, sálvame la vida. Wow, es mejor, gracias. Tú sale y me saca dos seguritos. Oh. <risa> So I'm already nervous and I'm like stressed. Yeah. I'm excited that my friends are here to like help out and everything. But like they're like being like moms and it just feels like really good to have like friend support. I'm just gonna like go with it and see what happens. So my dad made the box and it was like really last minute because we we're gonna order it, but then it would not like came in time, so he made it. I was really scared that like the door wasn't working at first, so then they were like, oh, well, if um, it doesn't work, then you're just gonna have to stay in there, like try your best to like get out. And so then that's why like I told him to knock before, like he would open, so I would know. I'm gonna come out just as Selena and I'm really excited for everyone's reaction because I don't think anyone's like really expecting me to like do something like that.
everyone was gonna pay attention to like the pins. I don't think anyone noticed, so it looked fine. So I just got around and like threw it. But I was really nervous because it could have untied from the back and like everything would have fallen. El cambio de ropa me estresé mucho, 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 porque yo pensé que era muy rápido. Lo hicimos en la casa como en cinco minutos, pero lógico, la maestra tiene sus técnicas y sus tácticas. ¿Los lentes? Ay, los lentes, los lentes. Están? están en la maleta. Trae la maleta, corre, Trae la maleta. Corre. Dile que el Johnny que te espere. Yo, para mí, era la primera vez que iba a hacer eso. Me tomé yo creo que como uno, media hora o 40 minutos. No tomé el tiempo, pero sentí que se me pasó muy rápido. Yo les digo que se apure. No, espérate, ya les digo que se espere. Es que ya ve, yo decía que acá te cambié. Es que yo te Cuando dije, del vestido. yo te dije que allá no. Ya, yeah, just like, oh, we're so behind. Todo va a salir bien. No. My dad has to bring my, my glasses for the dance. Why does he keep talking? <laughs> I was really frustrated because I didn't have the socks, the shoes, or the glasses. And then I was also really frustrated because my hair wasn't supposed to be down, it was supposed to be up. Ella, you're gonna have to use these. No, no, I'm not right there. I felt like, oh my god, like this is a disaster. So I'm really happy that I pulled everything off because I was honestly really like nervous about the dances because I didn't know how I was gonna do and I kind of for the rock one we really didn't really have a routine like it was just like kind of like through text like oh you do this you do that and it was like however it comes out so I'm really happy that everyone like did it right and like pulled through. I was surprised because that dance was only supposed to be with me and my uncles and instead like my whole family came in which is like good like I feel like it looked better. Everything went well, like I'm just happy how it went. I'm thankful for everything that they did for me because like I didn't honestly I didn't really think that my party was gonna be this big. Like, you know, at first I had my vision for like my game set to like take a trip or just be at like my house. And then like they convinced me to like have a big party, invite all my family and like I'm happy that they convinced me because like now I like love it. So it's really like I feel like everyone put like enough effort into it. They got me everything I wanted and I'm just really thankful for them for doing that and I know they did it with like a lot of sacrifice so I'm just thankful. It was it was definitely my dream kissing at Thanks for watching my episodes. Comment down below your favorite part. And make sure to subscribe to Awesomest TV Quinceañera.